Yeah, my name is Brian Baird and I direct the Coast and Ocean Program at an organization called the Bay Institute, which is also affiliated with the Aquarium of the Bay and has a parent organization known as Bay.org. And our job is to try to find ways to reduce environmental impacts to San Francisco Bay and the coast and the ocean. Well, there's lots of ways that, that fishing gear can get lost. And a lot of people don't understand that, that fishing boats are complex. Weather conditions are, are very, very difficult to predict. There can be mechanical issues. There's all sorts of ways that this equipment uh, can be lost. Fishermen are trying their best to come up with ways to reduce the loss. We're all here today to try to, to help and come up with creative ways to keep this equipment from going into the ocean. And for the equipment that goes in the ocean, we're hoping to find better ways of retrieving it. Well, the Bay Institute is an organization that is concerned with the health of the San Francisco Bay watershed from the Sierra Nevada all the way out to the ocean. Uh, my specialty is dealing with the coast and ocean. A big issue that we, we found out about uh, years ago, about 2005, is this issue of lost fishing gear out uh, in, in the ocean. Uh, and the Bay Institute was approached to try to put together a session, bring together experts, try to come up with some summary material so we could explore ways to reduce the loss of gear and to come up with more effective ways of responding and bringing that gear back out of the ocean. Well, the great thing about this program is the Bay Institute is a small uh, non-governmental organization. It is very difficult to come up with funding for these sorts of events. Uh, thankfully, the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation uh, put out a, a request for proposals on this issue which allowed us uh, a little bit of money to go do the background research that was necessary to consult with lots of experts. We, we consulted with what turned out to be almost 30 experts on putting together a background paper and to make all of the arrangements to make, make this event happen. So we're very, very thankful for the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation for providing the funding for this event. The thing about the Bay Institute is we're kind of a jack of all trades. So we're looking at all sorts of impacts to the coast and ocean. Uh, in this particular issue, we tr did our best to try to identify the, the things that are happening, but we did go to experts located throughout the entire state of California to guide us in this so that we could really kind of zero in on what is the, the most important kinds of, uh, of issues that we could, we could hopefully uh, address. Again, focused on can we reduce the loss of this gear and, and can we recover this gear? Do we need research to learn how to do a better job at these things? That's what this is all about. A great part about this event is that the Bay Institute is an objective party that can come into this issue. We can talk to all the experts, and experts tend to differ from, from time to time. And the whole idea is to bring these experts with different points of view together into a public forum, have them say what they're going to say, and then a major emphasis tonight is going to be a question and answer period where we've got a lot of people in this audience who are very, very engaged in this issue and many of them have very strong opinions. So it's our hope we're going to really engage this issue tonight between these experts, members of the public, and then hopefully by the end we will be producing some very specific and, and, and concrete recommendations to send on to the federal government and to send on to the state government. What's exciting about our event is that right now the federal government is issuing a request for proposal for people to come to them with ideas for how to reduce the loss of fishing gear and to come to them with ideas for how to recover fishing gear that is lost. So this is perfect timing for that. And also the state of California has a comprehensive uh, policy on marine debris or all the things that go into the ocean that shouldn't be there. So once again, Tonight, we're going to come up with recommendations that hopefully will go into the development of that statewide marine debris policy, and maybe we can make a difference tonight. That's what it's all about.